Nobody else has arrived still. That well, seems very strange to me. Anyway, whilst we're waiting, Sooty got a little bit peckish, which is why he's just had the ice cream. Do I feel hungry? Well, actually, I do. I, I could really, really fancy a nice plate of bangers and mash. What? You remember bangers and smash? What's, what's bang? Oh, I know what you mean. Bangers and smash. That's stock car racing, isn't it? I remember the day that we went stock car racing. Do you remember that? Well, here it comes. You know, everyone who's young at heart loves playing with toy cars. And Sweet is no exception. Here he is, up bright and early, pretending that his car is the fastest car in the world. Vroom, vroom, it goes. Vroom. This really is a fast car. It's travelling at a terrific speed. Oh, it's run into the paw of the law. <coughs> well now, laddie, says Police Constable Sooty, do you have an excuse for driving that car at over twice the speed limit? <coughs> yes, sir, sweet. Oh, you was rushing to the hospital, was you? <coughs> oh, to visit your sick granny, eh? <coughs> well, as it happens, I've just had a cup of tea with your granny in her own kitchen not ten minutes ago, <coughs> which means that you, my lad, are nicked. <coughs> what for? <coughs> Why... For speeding, my lad, you are banned from driving till lunchtime, plus there is a five-pound fine. Evening all. Hello, sweet. <coughs> Whose car is this? It's yours. Oh, I see. It's a nice car, isn't it? Hmm. Yes, sweet. What am I doing? Oh, I'm just writing something out. It's for you, actually, sweet. It. It's a parking ticket, actually. You are in a no parking zone. That's a five pound fine, I'm afraid. Yes, five pounds. Does the car only cost five p? At a jumble sale. Well, I'm sorry, sweet, but the ticket's written now. Have a nice day. Fine, did you? Yes, Matthew. <laughs> oh, you should have seen his face. Yeah, I'm sure. What's it? He really believed you. Mm. You are awful to that poor little dog. Oh, hang on, he's coming up. Oh, hello, sweet. Sweet. I see it's turned out to be um another fine day. <laughs> oh, dear, tell him, Matthew. All right, sweet, sweet. Listen, you don't have to pay the fines. No, they were only kidding you. It was a joke. <laughs> mind you, mind you, sweet. You do get a bit out of hand. What with your car game? You just love fast cars. Yes, well, so do I. As a matter of fact, that's why I've decided to do something about it. If you like fast cars, mm -hmm. meet me upstairs in the loft room. Right. Good God. Are you going to join me? Come on, then. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. Beep, beep. Vroom, vroom. Now, some of you may have heard of the Monaco Grand Prix. Well, this is a Matenko Grand Prix, and this is the racetrack. What do you think? Good, eh? What do you think, you three? Wow. It's, it's crucial. It's yes. amazing, Matthew. I agree, Sue. Do you like it, Sooty? Mm. Right, well, this is what we're going to do. I think it should be ladies first. So, Sue, you race against uh, you race against Sooty. You'll find oh, little plunges down there. This is Sue's car here on the outside, and this is Sooty's car here. Now, these are the lap counters over here. See, Sooty and Sue got their names up there. We're going to have 30 seconds, and at home, cheer on the person that you want to win. So, are you ready, you two? Right. You're under starters' orders. Are you ready? Steady. Go! And they're off! And they're off! And it's Sue! Sue's ready. And Sue's come off the track. You come off the track. Sue's gone. See if you can catch her. Come on, see if you can catch her. So she's doing well. One, two laps each. Come on, Sue's just coming off. Oh, Sue's oh, come, come off. What a shame. Where's the boat? Come off now. Just a minute. There we go. Okay, Sue, right. Off you go. So she's come off down the bottom of it. Completely upside down. Oh, well done. You've got 21 seconds. 21 seconds. Oh, oh, steady, steady. Nearly there, 20 seconds. Nearly, nearly finished. 27 seconds. 29. Stop, stop, stop race. Stop the race. Stop the race. Now, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Five to Sue and five to Sooty. Now, who's in the lead? I think that Sooty's in the lead. Here we have Sooty's car. He's in the lead. Well done, Sooty. Oh, okay, so Sooty's in the lead. Sue, give yours to Sweet, can you? Right. Let's put these back here. We'll have another go now. Another go now. And this time, it's Sweet racing against Sooty. So let's put Sweet's name there. Okay. Press that. Cheer on the one that you want to win. 30 seconds. Okay. Are you ready? Steady. Go! Go on. Go on. Up you go. go on. That's it. Oh, hang on a minute. Somebody's come off there. Somebody's come off there. That's it. Come on. Up you go, come on. Come on, that's all right, it's you, it's you. Come on. Come on. There we go. Up you go, up you go. Come on. Well, there's a tire there. Come on, come on, keep, keep racing, keep racing. Come on, oh, this is very close, very close. We've done two laps, we've done three laps. Who's going to win? Who's going to win? It's all very close. Take it easy. This is very, very exciting. 
It's nearly there. We're nearly at 30 seconds. Hang on. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Stop the race. Stop the race. And who's won? We've got Sweep on five laps. And Sooty on six laps. So, Sooty, you are the winner. Well, well done. done. We have prize to give to the winner, haven't we, to Sooty? Yes, yes, we have, Matthew. Yes. OK, I'll but get Matthew, it. What? Don't what? you think Sweep should have it, as we've been so nasty to him this morning? That's a very nice thought. I think you're right. So, Sweep, because Sue's just asked me, you can have the prize, which is a little model car. Yay! Play, play with it straight away. <laughs> He's going to play with it straight away. Sweep is in for one or two surprises. You see, that car is one of a pair. That was one of them, and this is the other one, <laughs> but it somehow got a little bit damaged. <laughs> oh, well, hi, Sweep. Um, how's the car going? Fine. Well, it sounds a bit rough to me. I think it could do with a service. Yes, a sort of 6,000 metre service. And, Sweep, as luck would have it, a garage is open just nearby. Sooty, come and have a look at this car, please. It'll have to go in. Yes, I thought as much. It needs a little attention, Sweep. Well, there's your car, Sweep. Mm. Oh, and here, by the looks of it, Sweep, is your fill. Sweep, you keep falling for them. Oh. That's not the real one. But you won it. No, you didn't, Sweep. No, 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 no. This is the one which you won. That's it. But listen, because we keep teasing you, Sweep, I've decided to let you have um, this. Wow, look at that. That's yeah. a real beauty. Fantastic, isn't it? What sort, of, what sort is it? That is a Ferrari 126C4, that is. Oh, well, you must be very keen on racing cars to know all that, Matthew. Oh, I love racing cars. Do you know I'd like to have a going one just once? Just what? Why don't I organise it? Well, it's not that easy to organise oh, something like that. Oh, I don't like know. That. What? Why? Look at this advert in today's paper. Listen, lessons in high-speed driving. What? Let's look at that. High-speed driving? Where is it? Oh, yes. It... Lessons in high-speed driving. Instructress Sarah Speedring. I... Instructress? Well, what's wrong? <laughs> well, come on. That... Instructress, that... that means that she's, you know, a woman. Yes. Well, come on, Sue. I mean, I'm not being instructed by a, a woman driver. What's this? What's wrong with women drivers? Well, look, I, I don't want to get into a big, heavy argument here, but let's just say that this... What's her name? Spare Sarah Speedrick. I very much doubt if there's anything she could show me. I've been driving for 20 years. Anyway, I'm a male. Yes, a male chauvinist. You still haven't answered the question. Now, what is wrong with women drivers? Well, nothing, Sue, really, except that men are better, that's all. I mean, mm. look, 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 look. If you, Sue, and I were on a racetrack, then I would prove to you that men are better drivers. <laughs> Goodness me. Do you know something? You would fall apart. Yeah, I'd show you a thing or two. Just you and me, Sue, on a real race racetrack with real cars. Really? In that case, look at the advert underneath the one for the racing car tuition. What? Where? Oh, here. Yeah. Uh, all the excitement of a real race. Hire yourself ten laps of excitement on a real racetrack with real cars. Challenge a friend. Challenge you... a friend, eh? You... Well, you have, Matthew. Have and I... what is more, I accept. You do? <laughs> <laughs> There you are. Right. Well, I've had a word with the manager of this place, and he says that I'm all right. Uh, actually, Sue, because she is so small, she's got to go with an experienced driver. Still, never mind. I don't mind. It's still me against her, so far as I'm concerned. So, uh, whereabouts are the racing cars? Over there. What? Sue? Baldy? We'll see about this. Right. What is the meaning of this? I thought these were meant to be racing cars, Sue. Well, they are cars, and we are about to race in them, so I guess that makes them racing cars. <laughs> Typical female logic, eh? Hey, who's this? This is my co-driver. Oh, hi. <laughs> Strong grip. Mind you, big fella. Or maybe it's just you, who's a bit of a wimp. What? Right, that does it. That is war, Sue. Right, but don't forget that all's fair in love and war. Right, make sure you stay safe back there. Ready, Mr. Starter? We're ready to start the race. OK. Well, I've said that I'll go in the rear car because I'm the more experienced driver. So, it's seatbelts on and... Uh, oh. Hi, boys. Hi. So, all spare in love and war, eh? Well, we'll see about that. <laughs> Here, put down. <laughs> well, he did 
let's say it was war, let's go! Right, this is war! driving with it, didn't you? I'm not standing for this. I am going to complain. Excuse me. Sorry. Yes, it was terrific, but I couldn't have managed without my co-driver. <laughs> Sweet wants to shake your hand. Ah, there you are. Yes, hard luck, Matthew. Still, someone's got to win. Yes, and it would have been me, wouldn't it, if it hadn't been for your co-driver here? This was meant to be a race between men drivers, that's me, and women drivers, that's you, but because of your co-driver, you, I'm afraid, are disqualified, Sue. So, sorry, Sue. Sorry, John. My co-driver's name isn't John. Allow me to introduce you. Matthew, this is my co-driver, Sarah Speedring. Yeah, I'm sure it... Hello, John. Oh! Bitten! By a... By a woman! <laughs> <laughs> all right, so all right, you don't have to rub it in. Okay, well. so she was a better driver than me. All right, so she was a much better driver than me. And women drivers in general? Okay, I've changed my mind about them. They are better than men sometimes. Sometimes they're much better than men. All right, sometimes they're much better than men. Hey, 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 what about those cars? Yes, yeah, they were fun, weren't they? Yes, they certainly were. But, you know, I think I'll stick to my own little runabout. <laughs> And you'll stick to yours. I don't blame you, Sweep. What about you, Sooty? You're being quiet. Uh, Sue, I think I know the reason for that. Yes. You see, Sooty, being a magical bear, has got a car which is more fantastic than this one. <laughs> it's more amazing than the cars that we were driving around in, Sue, mm -hmm. and it is more brilliant than any racing car you can imagine. Am I right, Sooty? <laughs> what sort of a car is it? Why, it's Sooty's Sooty Mobile. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. It's a very special car. It can go. You 
Bobby Lee, the line.